Ed Danita, sports in so many ways provides often a relief, a, a mental break, if you will, especially in troubling times. Tonight's Chardon game in South Canton was a good example of that, marking the end of a very stressful 24-hour period. Canton South High School sits a good hour and a half from Chardon, but on this night, there was the feel of a home game as fans dressed in red and black made the trek to Stark County. We always back our toppers. The community involvement that we have with our team is it goes deep, so we wouldn't miss it. To be clear, not all the support for Chardon was from Chardon. South Canton making the Hilltoppers feel welcome. Because we just need to show our support even here in Canton, you know, for, for the people in Chardon and what they've all gone through. There was no special ceremony or moment of silence. Last night's escape shining an unwanted spotlight on Chardon for unwanted reasons by a person who they just assume never speak of again. As a result, the media here kept in a cordoned off area behind the end zone to allow those looking to take a break from reality to do that. I think everybody just wants it to be over and it resurfaced again. I don't know. There's a lot of emotions flying. Tammy Sakelin teaches at Chardon, but is from Canton. She's touched by the outside support. It means everything. It does. It just shows that Northeast Ohio um, has kind of wrapped their arms around us as a community, as a high school, and it does mean a lot to the students and the staff. Tammy is also the Chardon Teachers Union president. She says for many, the escape unleashed emotions, the capture, relief. We spent some time today together and uh, some teachers went ahead and, you know, had some quality time with their families today, so that was good. And the seniors playing here tonight were mere freshmen back in February of 2012, and their graduation next spring will mark a changing of the guard from a school that is recovering to one that is remembering. In Canton, John Kosick, New Channel 5.